So, um, hi, uh, I'm using my webcam today, and for some reason, because it's a webcam, it makes me look really, really awful, like it really shows up on my zits and stuff, and how crappy my hair is, so uh, I put headphones on, so that it kind of hides it, shouldn't have admitted that, should I? <laughs> uh, no. Anyway, what I wanted to say was that today, we kind of hit a milestone within the project, in that on our Twitter page, we reached 40 followers about 10 minutes ago. Now that may sound really crappy, but considering I only had 28 followers this afternoon, I think that's pretty impressive. And it's all down to one lady who retweeted a tweet that I tagged her in, that is Miss is Anna Kennedy OBE. So I'd just like to say thanks to you for really helping me out. And I hope we can collaborate in the future. And what's really weird is that me and this Anna Kennedy actually have kind of linked before in that a couple of months ago, can't remember exactly when, um, I they were discussing autism on the radio and I phoned in to speak to my friend um, Jenny Barnett, who's the host of uh, BBC London on weekends and um, I was the penultimate caller and um, even though I kept hinting yeah I've got Asperger's and epilepsy she completely ignored the latter and then um, I said goodbye after my minute chatting to her or whatever and this woman came on to talk about her sons who have autism and the school she'd set up for them and the book she'd written about the whole experience and stuff and that was Anna Kennedy so I guess you could call it fate, or you could call it timey me rubbish. <laughs> yeah. I then went on Facebook all excited, oh my god, I got 40 followers, that's so awesome. And then got kind of a bit of a blow, like a punch in the chest, metaphorically. Like when I watched the final episode of Derek. In that I noticed people were updating statuses about things like, I'm gonna miss you, Matt Smith. Good luck, Matt Smith. And I was like, what the hell? Oh no! Because, you see, no matter what I've said in the past, you know, I've always said he's a, sh you know, he, the Eleventh Doctor's a great character, but Matt Smith's a shit actor. You know, that that series finale, he really won me over, and I'm kind of upset now. You know, and I just really hope that he does an awesome regeneration. And I just hope he does one that is really good, and I hope it's a really good story to say goodbye to him too. And I can just see that this is the beginning of a great career for him, because he is... He is so young still, you know, that is the difference between him and Tennant, who will always be my favourite. You know, nothing can beat Tennant, in my opinion, at the moment, you know. But he is so young, and I just hope that in ten years' time, or whatever it is, he will be able to be my main star. So I just thought I'd get that out there while I was still feeling hyped, and um, huh, I can't think of any... Hyped is a really bad word to try and rhyme to. The only other word I can think which is an assonance is psyched, but that kind of means the same as psyched. So, yeah, that's all I had to say, really. Um, thanks for watching everything and following everything, and please just keep doing so and keep spreading the word, because I run this, this project as if it's a business, and today it was like, I feel like um, today we made our first sale. I feel like Olivia Coleman just won my first BAFTA after deserving it for so long. I feel like Matt Smith leaving Doctor Who. I've, I've had my first successful role and I'm about to go on and be Britain's greatest actor. Enough metaphors. I will see you when I make my next official video. Goodbye. Very quickly before I officially leave, this is a new webcam. My last one died. Uh, I used to make blogs only on webcams uh, and then I realised, hang on a sec, what's the point? I have a video camera and could just use that. Um, and one thing I hate about webcams, apart from the fact that they make you look city, which kind of is just telling the truth, you, when you're an Italian who overuses their hands, you just look like there's flashing going everywhere whilst you're talking, so, bleh. <laughs>